Um, we're going to be speaking about Mark Lamont Hill. Now, Mark Lamont Hill is in the news once again, um, just being a crazy guy, let me tell you. Uh, ever since he got fired, you know, um, he's letting loose, let me tell you. And he's going after the Jews and he's going after white Americans. And Mark Lamont Hill says that he blames Israel for police killings of blacks in the U.S. Um, it, it, uh, it's just uh, kind of uh, crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, let me go ahead and read a little bit here. And it says that after CNN firing, Mark Lamont Hill blames Israel for police killings of black people and opposes renouncing uh, Farrakhan. Speaking on the Breakfast Club radio program, Hill addressed the controversy stemming from his November 28th speech at the United Nations in which he endorsed the boycott, divestment, and sanctions campaign against Israel in pursuit of a free Palestine from the river to the sea, a call typically used by Arab uh, nationalists and Islamist groups to advocate for the establishment of a uh, Palestinian state from the Jordan River to the Mediterranean Sea. Now, uh, this campaign itself is often criticized for rejecting the Jewish people right to self-determination and denying Jewish of an indigenity of uh, to the Levant. Um, I don't. I'm not too familiar with that. So. What do you what do you think about this whole jazz with uh, Mark Lamont Hill? Well, what he what he's saying there, Jermaine, is that the buzzword um, a Palestinian state from the river to the sea is a euphemism for wiping out everybody that lives there now, which are um, six and a half million Jews. Uh, that's where the Jewish state is from the Jordan River to the sea. The sea is the Mediterranean Sea, and that would be mass murder on the size of the Holocaust, killing another six and a half million. Now, since he said that at the UN in front of a national and international audience, he now says, well, he didn't mean to kill everybody. He just wanted the country eliminated. Okay, great. So what does he do a week later or two weeks later, I guess now? He makes a speech where he says that the reason why police in the largest police force in the world, the New York Police Department, kill black people is because of the Israeli training of some of their special forces. That's insane. <laughs> I mean, you couldn't be more anti-Semitic, you couldn't be more racist, and yet he gets away with it. Jermaine, answer me this. How is it possible that left-wing, progressive, radical CNN gets it but Temple University will not fire this guy. They just won't fire, no matter what he says, he's still on the faculty at Temple. And their faculty review board says, well, those are his opinions, we don't agree, but he can say it. What if he just came out and said, let's kill them all? Does he still get to be a professor at Temple? If Absolutely. so, I hope the donors run away, never give him another penny, I hope all the trustees resign, and eventually when, this, when the whole campus starts to fall apart, they can put it at the feet of the crazy guy they didn't have the uh, courage to get rid of when they should have. He keeps getting a microphone because the, the, the networks are so stupid as to put a microphone in front of this guy and turn it on. By the way, after calling for the murder of six million Israelis, Still has his Twitter account, Jermaine. Mm -hmm. Still has his Facebook page. Yep. Still has his own platform. And all the networks still publicize him. And I bet you a dollar he's still welcome at the UN next time they have their next racist agenda, which, if they're in session, is next week. Because that's what they do at the UN. The guy's disgusting. And I wish the rest of America would just wake up and get it. Yeah, you know, I do too. And what this fool says is that he says, remember, I ain't talking about Jewish people. He says, I'm talking about the Israeli, Israeli state. I mean, <laughs> this guy here, you know, I'm telling you, he is dumb. So there's no way to get around this, Barry. Um, 
He is for the destruction of the Jewish state. Well, he, he says is he for is. the destruction of the Israeli people. That's you can't get around it. That terminology, everything that he is saying, and, and this whole uh, crap about just because the Israeli uh, training force has trained maybe some of the uh, cops in New York, or maybe all, oh, I have no idea about their training. Based upon that, that's the main reason why he's saying that. I mean, uh, you you got to be retarded to think like this. Where does the line of insanity stop, Barry? I just don't less know. Than, less than 1% of the New York Police Department has ever met an Israeli or ever been <laughs> trained by an Israeli or ever put eyes on an Israeli. But in his mind, because a couple of them got trained, the other 10,000 on the street are racist, anti-black killers. Yeah. Because of his because of Israel, I mean, it is the most illogical, racist comment I've heard since the last thing Farrakhan said, whatever he said. Because they're always racist and they're always illogical. And by the way, just for the nexus there, Mark Lamont Hill loves Farrakhan, and Farrakhan loves Mark Lamont Hill. They are two brothers in their anti-Semitism, in their anti-American, and their anti-Israel rhetoric. Absolutely. Barry, thank you, thank you, thank you, sir. We are out of time. Ladies and gentlemen, Barry Newspoon from American Truth Project. Why don't you go ahead and tell the folks here, we got a whole bunch of people watching. Um, why don't you tell them where they can find your stuff at, um, if they want to donate, where they can help your mission. Please go to find findberry.com will take you to American Truth Project on the web. You'll see our articles, you'll see our videos, you'll see everything we stand for. It's uh, like what we did today, just a lot more of it. Findberry.com, you're welcome to check us out. It's always free. Everything you sign up for, you never get charged for. Drop in your email and you'll get our mailers twice a week. Absolutely, and ladies and gentlemen, this is his website. Make sure you guys go ahead and check Barry out, all right? AmericanTruthProject.org.